I like the theme song. If there's one thing that Winx Club has gotten right every season, it was their theme songs. I disagree. You disagree? Yes, I do not like that music. I don't know what it is. It just feels too... Uh, it's like, it's okay. I'll say it's okay. But it's nothing that I would ever, that would ever get me, you know, it doesn't hit me in any way. It's kind of, it feels so... Uh, what's the word? Not basic, but kind of, um... Childish? No, not childish. Just... Like, they haven't got anything in it that really adds anything. Which one? They had a lot. They changed it every season. They made a bunch of them. Which theme song do you, can you think of off the top of your head that you don't like? Um... If a desire, you can become... Yeah, I, didn't. I didn't like that one that much. The way I love is to get up and play. I like that one. You didn't like that one. Okay. I liked it when I was little, but going back and listening to the songs, I just don't like that genre. I don't think. Like that yeah. really over it's not something I would put in my playlist again. Exactly. No, I would do the one they had Symphonique on where she was like, do you know the power you have? Can you feel the magic that is inside of you? Come with us. You'll understand that you are magic if you just believe that it's true. It's amazing what you can do with some magic to show you. That girl can sing. Don't tell me nothing. It's not special, but it was a good theme song. Which one do which one came after that? Now, if there's a theme song I hate it besides the first one. I didn't like that one where it was, um, Wait, we're back again. Wait, we're friends. I was like, what is this? What the, um, the, I don't know if this was the first one. It was like, wait, I don't, I don't even remember the lyrics. I just remember the melody. It was like, Wait, da 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 the singing was not bad. Like the voices, I can like because I think the same lady did all the other theme songs. I don't care about that. The lyrics, the composition, all of it put together. What am I listening to? A travesty. That's what it is. <laughs> Wait, I thought you just said you liked the music. I liked. It. Forget what I said. <laughs> I did not like it at all. It just felt right. like it caught me off guard most of the time. Like I just hear that, I hear that sizzle, and then it's like, <laughs> let me see if I could play. Am I still gonna get scared? Because like, I remember when I was little, I used to watch it in like the middle of the night, and that theme song would just <laughs> the drums would get you, huh? Do you remember when um they were with a band? I didn't like that either. If Musa is the musical person and she's the singer and she's the this and she's the that, why would they give that to Bloom? Exactly, because see, there's ha I can understand, I can understand having a star, but you have, you have to have balance. Everything can't constantly be about one person. Exactly. I'm sure they have some episodes where, you know, where Musa, uh, what was it, like Stella and Flora were having roommate trouble or something. And of course, when they introduced Aisha, she had the whole thing with her family. They have episodes where they focused on other characters, but each season was so focused. I think whenever they try to focus on other characters, it's always a travesty. Like, it's always something bad happening. And it's like, so is everything good supposed to happen to Bloom? I do remember the. Like I said, the brand new thing with the season with Dark War and how they were underground. <laughs> What's her face? Oh, man. Goodness, that episode was weird as heck. <laughs> Can we talk about the lack of feminism? I I'm just, it's a joke, but when I say what I'm about to say, it sounds smart. Okay. Brandon falls off a cliff and falls into the water. Stella doesn't know he fell into the water, but she instantly goes, I'm going to jump off with him. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty 
pretty stupid. Are we watching the same show? This show is crazy. I think they did a pretty good job. With the, okay, okay, no. I take that back. They did not, they did an okay job with the girl power thing. They, they pushed it a lot, that's for sure. A lot. As did everything else on Nickelodeon and Disney Channel. But I also think that they kind of, they also kind of contradicted themselves a little bit. Like, first of all, the design of the characters, right? Like, they all look exactly the same. Their faces are all the same. Like, they are also kind of pushing a certain beauty standard, if you know what I mean. And also being like, oh, it's real power. Like, you know, you need to have diversity, first of all. Yeah. I mean, they kind of did. Like, I mean, I could see Flo. I could see Flora being maybe Hispanic. I see, obviously, Musa is Asian. I is black, and Techna is German. That's still white, though. So you got four white characters, and you got, never mind, not four. You got three white characters, and everybody else is first. I guess I'm mean more like, way with the way, I don't know if I'm making the sense. They kind of all have the same blood attack and kind of the same faces, same eyeballs. I think they should have made, like, okay, say, I think they were scared to offend people, because I was saying maybe you could give Aisha a little more weight, and then have Techna be like, no, 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 give, make Aisha curvy, not, not big, have her be curvy, because then we would be talking about stereotypes if they made her, like, big. But give Aisha a little more curves. I think maybe Techna or Flora, maybe one of them should have struggled with obesity. Like, let's let's put some real world in it. Like, yeah. stuff. They, they could have been well, some real world things. And maybe it's, just, maybe it's just the fact that it bothered me how it looked like they were missing about 14 ribs. <laughs> they were just like, what, what did they look like? They came like, like lady who got like three, four of her ribs removed. Like this string. That's how skinny they were. <laughs> nobody looks like that. No, nobody. And then and people that try don't almost live. <laughs> they don't. But I mean, I guess it was the art too, so I'm not gonna be too mad. Let's go. They contradicted themselves. one of the biggest would be the animal. The, the art style was cool. <laughs> the art style was cool. But like I said, how still they moved and also how their expressions they always match the words that were coming out of their mouth. You know what I mean? They were just like, I'm going to the storm. <laughs> and then you know how this, oh god, the sound effects. Like, the, oh, oh. Whenever Stella had like a glass of water, it's like glug, 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 glug. <laughs> her voice was pretty raspy. She sounded old. Like I Stella sounded like 30 years old. My goodness. She's supposed to be Oh, can we talk about the giggles? I hated the giggles. <laughs> it was um it was the movie whenever they were transforming during the Sirenix movie. They were doing their transformation or whatever, and then say Bloom is done, and they're getting ready to go into the next person. You just hear a. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> now get. Yeah, I usually watch when I was younger. I was watching this at like twelve o'clock at night, so I'm just like, <laughs> what is this? Oh, I was haunted that summer. I was haunted that summer. <laughs> Why you gotta giggle like that? <laughs> oh goodness. Yeah. Some of those <laughs> their voiceovers were a little bit rocky. And you know how when they would be taken aback or surprised or something, you'd be like, <laughs> oh. it'd be like a double gas or something. <laughs> oh. Oh. Their arms <laughs> just pulled out. It was so 
so Just weird. Just watch Winx Club with your eyes closed. You're going to be like, am I watching a kid's show? Or is this something? <laughs> <laughs> what am I watching? <laughs> That's well, my guys, calm down. Especially when the specialists were there and they were being mixed together. <laughs> and then Scott, Scott would be like, huh? Huh? Uh. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay. Funny. Let's talk about how Nickelodeon, when they wanted, they redubbed um, season four. And in the original version, Nabu is like, will you marry me? And then in Nickelodeon, he says, will you be my forever girlfriend? <laughs> if that's the plot you wanted to do, then have her say no. Forever girlfriend. How fitting is that nowadays? <laughs> but I guess that's a good note to wrap up on for our first episode of our series uh, talking about Winx Club. You know, if you all enjoyed this video, please leave a like, subscribe, comment down below, share the video, whatever you want to do, and I will see you guys next time. Why you do that? <laughs> <laughs> I can't <laughs> Hey guys, see ya. <laughs>